As reports continue to mount about mass civilian killings by Russian forces in Ukraine, the UN has made the rare move of suspending Russia from its leading human rights body. The resolution to kick Moscow out of the Human Rights Council garnered 93 votes in favour. 24 countries voted for Russia to stay in, stay in with almost 60 abstaining. Our Kim Yozan has more. The UN General Assembly on Thursday decided to suspend Russia from the organization's leading human rights body over alleged violations and abuses of human rights in Ukraine. 93 countries voted in favor of the U.S.-led resolution. 24 countries voted against, including North Korea and China, with 58 abstaining. The resolution expresses, quote, grave concern at the ongoing human rights and humanitarian crisis in Ukraine. Speaking after the vote, Russia's deputy UN ambassador announced that Moscow has decided to quit the council. The Russian Federation made a decision about ending or suspending its membership in the Human Rights Council before the end of its term on the 7th of April this year. Russia has always considered the Human Rights Council as an important component of the universal system of promoting and protecting human rights. Unfortunately, in today's conditions, the Council is in fact monopolized by one group of states who use it for their short-term aims. This was echoed by the Kremlin, which expressed its regret about the decision. The EU's ambassador to the UN, however, stressed that the rare decision upholds the integrity of the international body. Suspension is necessary to uphold the integrity of the Human Rights Council, the authority of the General Assembly, and the credibility of the UN human rights system. The rare decision this Assembly has taken today sends a strong signal of accountability and hopefully will help preventing and discouraging more violations of human rights. Russia was in the second year of a three-year term in the 47-member UN Human Rights Council. Suspicions from the Council are rare. Libya was suspended in 2011 because of violence against protesters by forces loyal to then-leader Muammar Gaddafi. Kim Yusan, Arirang News.